Hey everyone, Will here with a channel update. Got a little bit of uh, Geometry Wars 3 in the background there, a great little arcade shooter. You can go ahead and check that out on Steam or something if you want. Just a little something for you guys to look at while I bring you guys up to speed on what's going on with my channel right now. To start off with, let's talk about Minecraft and uh, the Minecraft Hardcore series. It just finally concluded yesterday. I'm really happy with the way the series turned out, had a full good run. Uh, much to my surprise, uh, just as I was publishing the last video the other day, um, I realized that it had been, you know, 24 weeks, 6 months, I never even missed an episode, everything came out on time, feeling pretty great about that. Um, you know, went from start to finish, nothing to everything, like I typically do in most of the Minecraft worlds that I end up playing in. Had a lot of fun with it, I hope you guys go ahead and check that uh, series out, see the end of it. Um, there have been a lot of requests for the Minecraft series to, uh, you know, have like a walkthrough episode or something, so I might go back and have another episode next week, something like an epilogue, not entirely certain. Uh, but there's that, I hope you guys enjoyed the Minecraft series, and right now it's time for me to distance myself from Minecraft again, I need to take a step away from it, I need to be able to say, okay, this game, you know, it's fun, but I need to spend some time away from it, in order to not completely and totally burn out on it. So that's going to be, uh a thing. I'm not entirely certain how long Minecraft is going to be absent from my channel, but, uh, you know, it'll come back eventually. But with the hardcore Minecraft series over, it's time for me to take a break from Minecraft again, just so you guys know. And, um, the next thing to talk about is the more important part to talk about, and that's, uh, linked directly to why there's no Fallout New Vegas today. And the reason for that is I've actually become quite ill. About Two weeks ago, I started to feel not too great, and uh, you guys probably noticed that this past week there was no weekly content, there was no content on uh, Tuesday, Thursday, those are days that I try to put videos up, and there was just nothing in the past week. And the reason for that was, about two weeks ago, I started to feel not too great, and it became more and more difficult to work on uh, video content, and I didn't have anything built up for weekday content, so that was the first thing that uh, took a hit. But, um... I've uh, I felt so so poor for such a period of time that I just uh, I, it's actually become difficult for me to work on just the most important content for my channel, which is the content that goes up on the weekends. You know the uh, the Minecraft ep series and um, New Vegas. Now, luckily, I managed to get a bunch of recording in for the Minecraft series final episode before I started to really feel bad um, earlier this past week. And, um, you know, I've been to the doctor now, hopefully I'll be getting better and everything. Uh, I'm getting treatment, but the point is, it's gonna take time to recover. And before I got to the doctor, I was just feeling so terrible that I could not focus on my work. And this leads me to how much actual work goes into a single episode of the Fallout series. It's not something that I really advertise, but the Fallout series actually one 22, 25 minute episode actually takes a bare minimum of four hours of work. And that's if the episode is extremely easy and there's pretty much no dialogue with NPCs in it. The more dialogue with NPCs there are, the longer the time that it takes to produce the episode. So if there's no conversations at all, it'll take me about four hours. You know, that's everything included. The, uh, the process of recording the episode, editing through everything, rendering, quality checking, and then re-rendering. However, whenever it comes to uh, conversations in the Fallout series, I don't record those in real time. I go through the conversations without actually saying anything, and then I go back and uh, do a post-recording of all of the dialogue, so that it, it gives me an opportunity to make the conversations feel a lot more natural, there's no telling how a uh, NPC is going to react to a specific line of dialogue that the player is saying. If I know what the response to any particular statement is going to be, I can make the phrasing a lot more natural, and I can also make the conversations roll a lot better. But um, doing that whole process takes a lot more time. It, uh, it's an entirely separate recording session where I have to go back and watch my own footage again to get the NPC conversations to sound right. And then editing those together is a very, very intricate process. So the more dialogue dependent sections of New Vegas are extremely difficult to uh, get out on a time sensitive basis. That's the reason why it's a one episode per week situation. And as a result, the episodes that are almost entirely composed of dialogue, they can take anywhere from four to eight hours 
to edit. Um, actually, four hours would be the easier side, eight hours would be the most heavy side, and given that the series is currently leading me directly into the heart of New Vegas, there's significantly more dialogue, and that paired with the fact that I've been so ridiculously ill, ill to a point where I haven't been able to actually do anything. I, I can't focus on anything, I can't even play a game. Um, all I can do is sit and feel awful. Um, that just didn't really pair too well with uh, the extreme workload that is making an episode of Fallout New Vegas. So it's a series that's not going to go away, but I don't know how many episodes I'm going to be able to get out in the next week or so because I'm just, you know, not feeling up to par. And while I am getting better, that's something that's going to take time. So New Vegas is a really, really um, taxing series to make. And I just want you guys to understand that it's not that I'm abandoning it, it's just a lot of work and I have not been feeling well. So it's, um, it's going to be a little bit slow coming out. But other than that, there's some other content that I want to work on that's going to fill the gap now that Minecraft is uh, over and you know I'm going to take a break from it. We'll see what exactly I'm going to come up with. Maybe an older series might come back, nothing too extreme, uh, something easier to produce. But um, something else I'll say before I go is that I've been doing a reasonable amount of streaming over on Twitch. You've probably noticed that the uh, content that I put up on the weekdays, like the City Skyline play, um, the Starbound play a while back, as well as uh, some Bloodborne videos, they were all uh, a result of me streaming games on Twitch first. And uh, if you want to check that stuff out, you can go ahead and uh, follow me over on Twitch. You can also follow me on Twitter. I always tweet before I go and stream at all. Um, I'm not streaming on a regular basis. I don't really have a schedule. It's just something that I do for fun whenever I have time. And um, given that I have my high and my low points while I'm not feeling good, um, I'll have a period of time where I'm like, okay, I'm feeling good. I don't really want to, you know, do nose to the grindstone work um, like I usually do with video work. So I'm just going to stream instead. That's a lot easier and it's a lot more fun and a lot more, um, you know, hands off and uh, just goofy. So, uh, yeah, go ahead and follow me on Twitch if you can. Follow me on Twitter as well because I always tweet before I stream. And, uh, you know, just keep all of that in mind. I hope you guys are enjoying the stuff that I put up, and I'm really sorry about the slow content. Um, trust me, I'll get back to it, and believe me, I know that I need to take care of myself. It's just that, you know, I live through my work, I love what I do here, and, um, you know, entertaining you guys is really a big, important part of my daily life. So understand that I love what I do, and I'm doing my best to get better so that I can keep doing what I love. And hopefully you guys will understand that, you know, there are ups and downs to everything. So anyways... Thanks for listening, guys. Until next time, I'll see you later. Bye.